Ray Blackman here, and today um, I'm in front of the entrance to the skeleton farm. I'm actually kind of covering up the sign, but if I can finagle the camera here, you can kind of see. <laughs> the reason why is because the clips you're going to be seeing in this video are one is taken before the other. One is um, me giving a tour to walk of the place, and another is is then wired seeing the rest of the place. And neither one really shows, like, the one with walk doesn't show the entrance because I hadn't built it yet. So, like, the skeleton farm was mostly done except for the entrance on that one. And then Wired's one, um, I started recording after we gone through the entrance, so whoops on my part. And I decided it would be nice for you guys to get a little tour as well. So the clips are going to be mostly just reactions of Walk, who is a new member, and of Wired um, reacting to the skeleton farm. So, right now I'm going to give you guys a personal tour of this. So let's let's get started with this, shall we? Alright, so this is how you get in. I build a little design to make it obvious where the entrance is and you hit this, you fall. You land on this. Oh, somebody shut the door. Huh. <laughs> so this is the entrance. And as you see, I have a little statue here of myself. This is where armor that I've fixed up gets placed in, both enchanted and non-enchanted. And there's a little guidebook which I kind of need to update, but you guys can take a little read here. The reason why nobody can take boots is because Wired, you know, in our previous video, wanted the boots, and I promised him he could have the boots. So. That's why. In these things is actually stuff for people to take for free, um, if they want. Oh, by the way, this is the other part of the entrance. And you'll see what this is, um, at the end. Anyway, so, you can go on either side. Now, this is the secret I can show you guys. This is, you know, for me to do maintenance, fix things, whatnot. As you can see, I have a filter system for some of the stuff, like bones and arrows and whatnot, and then I don't have one for this one because it's for bows and armor. So, there's that. There's a trash can right here so you can get rid of too much storage, you know. And I have to say this thing, the arrows fill up really quickly. Where's the bones? Not as much. This stuff? A bit. Quite a bit. I should probably show you when the skeleton farm is on. So let me come up here and flick the switch. This is the on and off button for the, for the skeleton farm. And as you can see, this is where the items get shot out and head to the storage. And you can actually watch from up here as well, them being put in, although it's a little hard to see. And obviously this is the kill chamber. And there's two maintenance doors here, which are for me to be able to get up here in case I need to fix something, you know. And I can actually see skeletons coming through and whatnot. And then... And then we have this, which is, you know, in case I need to fix things in there. And up here, I found out, this is a little funny. I don't know why, but even if skeletons spawn down below, you can actually sleep in the bed. <laughs> so I put the bed there, because if I put the bed in that room, it doesn't work. And this is the door that leads to that little area which is right here. And over here is sort of a crafting and enchanting room. So like there's tons of 
stuff to put together and enchant or disenchant. There's even stuff in here. I designed it to where no matter where you are, they'll keep spawning. Unless you stand in these parts. If you stand on these blocks, you'll be spawning them. And I love that I kind of, without meaning to, kind of made this look like a magical chimney. <laughs> I kind of like that. And, oh yeah, we can actually see the skeletons coming through. See? They're actually coming through here. If any of you guys want a tutorial on how I designed this skeleton farm, please let me know down in the comments section and I'll go and do that. And this is a community sword for anybody to use. In fact, I've let quite a few members know that they can come by here and use this as like an XP farm. So I'm going to turn that off and get rid of the uh, last few stragglers. So that's pretty much it, you guys. So. And I'll see you in the next video. So, bye! Oh, now I see you. <laughs> nice. <laughs> I keep hearing chickens. Yeah, I think there's chickens in that house somewhere. That'd be like right here. I was trying to still get a couple eggs. Oh, okay. Alright. So, the new entrance is over here. Okay. And how you get in is you have to drop down. So you press that button, stand over the trapdoor, and you'll fall down. If you don't stand too close. <laughs> it's a little tricky. I'm going to have to make a better way to drop. Okay. I mean, and I guess obviously, that's the way up. Yep. And here's this oops. has changed a lot since last time I was here. Yeah. <laughs> I was on a maze of trying to figure out where to go, and I was like, uh, "Enough's enough. I'm not going to deal with this." <laughs> this is the guidelines. Let's see. Feel free to take all but the leather boots. Turn off farm when you're done. If you use the community sword, put back. That's all. Enjoy. I almost hit take book. Yeah, please don't. <laughs> There's um, bones free for the taking. Ooh, that might come in handy. And then, like, over here is all bows that have been healed up and stuff. Those are mainly okay. for dispensers and stuff. And then, um, nope, behind there, yeah, that's for <laughs> maintenance. <laughs> Everybody knows behind, always jump into the pictures. Yeah, well, that's the only picture that has that, trust me. <laughs> and this is storage for bones, and that's storage for arrows. Okay. And then this is for armor. This looks so cool in here. Thank you. <laughs> I, I do see, though, it. you yeah. like to stick with the darker colors of stuff for a palette. Yeah, I can't help it. I, it oh, it's... Feels, it feels spooky, so I like it. <laughs> yeah, I was say, because this matches the post office. The only difference is you actually have redstone lamps in here instead of, like, soul lanterns and stuff. This is a trash can, so if um, you need stuff to throw away, you just put it in okay. here, and it will dump it. This is for you to be able to see, you know... <laughs> You can actually watch the skeletons come through. Um, the farm is oh. turned off right now, so... Well, if you come this way, this is to the yep. farm. This is to upstairs for emergency case, like if the the turn off switch at the killing chamber is um, not working, there's this which will also turn it off. Okay. And then this is also where you can sleep if you want it to be daytime. Um, the uh, enchanting room. And I was asking if, about one of these the other day, and someone's like, there used to be one in spawn, but now there's one at the end. I was like, yeah, I'm not going. Yeah, well, now you have one here, too. This was actually in the farm. It's just uh, I had to remove it temporarily 
And that's okay. armor I'm working on, but you can feel free to take. And also, this is the armor I'm currently working on and trying to get better. You trying to get full enchantments on all the armor? To some degree, yeah. And this is another trash can, by the way. Okay, so and trash can have, on both sides. Yep. And you have everything you need, including this, in case you want to make something. <laughs> <laughs> that works. For sure. And yeah, if you want to... Uh, I've been staying up at night, trying to kill mobs. But gotcha. People like to sleep at night, too. Yeah. Well, this this is now free and open. You can come over here and use it as much as you want. I greatly appreciate that for sure. Turn on this, and this will activate the farm. And I'd also over inside, here, yes. oh, that's to turn on and off the farm. When the light's on, like the sign says, the farm is on. Okay. And the community sword is in this barrel. Oh. And there's also going to be music discs I'll work on adding into here in case you can listen to music. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I was standing right on the edge of the trapdoor. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I made it down. Whoa. <laughs> Dude. This was this this is this the same skeleton farm? Did yes. Just... <laughs> no. It is. No way. Here, here, I can even show you. Hang on. First of all, this is your secret entrance I made for you. You have to hold a rocket in your hand and then throw it down. It will give it back to you as well as open here. <gasps> I have a secret entrance. Oh my god, this is the best thing ever. <laughs> <laughs> and Oda, you didn't hear that, that rocket bit, okay? Uh, you didn't pick up your rocket. I heard it nothing. It gives it back to you. <laughs> oh, it does? Yeah. Okay, let me try that again. I, I I took it. Here, I'll give it back to you. Uh-oh. <laughs> okay, so... Th wait, the door's open now. Just do it again and it will shut it, and then you can reopen it. Oh, See? How did I do that? <laughs> oh! Okay, I got the rocket back. And now yep. it opens up. And there's a closing door for this side, so you can close and open the door over in this way, too. Dude, that's that's amazing redstone. I don't All even right. know the redstone. It loses <laughs> the magic otherwise. Okay, okay, I won't show you then. So this is oh, where the okay. skeleton farm used to be. You're right, yeah. Um, I've actually mined in here a little bit because I had to do a few things in here. But, yeah, yeah, this was my skeleton farm, yep. So you, you come in here, cycling them, the yep. whole way out is here. Yep, <laughs> which has now been changed. <laughs> wow. That's, dude, that's like, I don't know. <laughs> I'm feeling, <laughs> so, I'm feeling uh, it's kind of it's... like I'm trying to remin reminisce and also <laughs> feel like everything's changed oh. and it's better. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, feel free to take all but the leather boots. You like it? <laughs> I do need my leather boots. Yep. I hope you don't mind, but I've my also God. been working on them to make it, you a very good one. It's actually right here, but I'm still working oh, thank on you. it. Oh, I appreciate <laughs> that. I appreciate that. But you've gone, you've gone above and beyond with this project of yours. Well, this is my skill. I love making redstone stuff and redstone farms, and also making it look nice. Oh, yeah, I mean, yeah, it does look really nice. <laughs> oh, I like this text. That is nice. The block breaker sword. <laughs> yeah. Oh, skeletons. <laughs> I put I put a trap door in case somebody mines. They don't immediately fall <laughs> into the lava. <laughs> I mean, I have to say, so they, this you tr you actually deserve this. Like, all jokes aside, that this is amazing work. Thank you. <laughs> like, I'm I'm just like an awe, uh, dude. I may come by and do some more um, tweaking at times, but I'm oh, pretty yeah. much done. Thank you.